Hey everyone. So in the news this week, Mr. Potato Head, Mrs. Potato Head, they're being dropped from the name and they're just going to be called Potato Head. Everyone knows about this toy and I just want to explain my version of it. They're going to have a new package and it's going to be a, a multi-family package. It'll have two moms, two dads, a heterosexual person on it, and a child on the box. And that'll be the image of it. And back in the 1950s, Mr. Potato Head was just a bunch of pieces. Plastic parts, toys, human parts, like eyeballs, ears, noses, glasses. And what they would do is they would take these and put them on any vegetable they wanted. A potato, corn... You name it, a pumpkin, doesn't matter. And then they turned the real potato into a plastic potato and made it into a package. First off, the potato has been the most gender-neutral vegetable on the planet. And when I became a child, I played with this toy, and I would put hats and things, mustaches on the woman, or on the Mrs. Potato Head, I, I would put a wig on, on the Father Potato Head. I, it didn't matter. It was just a fun toy to mess with. And you just create your own version of the potato. It's just fun, you know. And I'm not traumatized from it, amazingly. Even though I, I don't even wear glasses. I don't even know where I got that hat. But this is where, I don't know, I think it's a marketing ploy. I think they're just creating more packages for all these things to create more business, which is fine. But I'm almost getting to the point where, okay, where, where does this get out of hand? You know, I mean, it's, it's kind of crazy. So I ended up picking up one of these packages, and it has a bunch of warning labels on the back, the multifamily package, the, the new one that is coming out. Uh, it says, number one, if you're under two years old, do not eat these plastic pieces. Duh. Okay, that makes sense. Number two. If you are Irish, this is not edible. Okay. Number three. This toy does not represent self-image if overweight. Okay. Number four. Do not attach a vagina, penis, or testicles to this toy. Okay. Number five, you are a special, wonderful, great child. Okay? And then at the bottom in giant asterisks and bold, it says, Manufacturer warranty is null and void if someone attempts item number four. I don't know. I just think people should just buy some used Tupperware at a garage sale. Buy a bunch of sand at Ace Hardware for like a buck a bag. Put a fence out in the backyard, throw your kids in there, throw the sand in there, throw the Tupperware in there. Go back inside, open up a hands beer, and just chill out with your gender-neutral partner or whoever you're with, and watch Skinamax, because I think we're just blowing all this out of proportion.